Liver cancer is a growing health problem, with 700,000 deaths and 800,000 new diagnoses globally every year. Large tumor variations make it incredibly difficult to pinpoint a single effective treatment. However, studying the relationship between cancer cells through space and time and at scale offers researchers new insights that could change our fundamental knowledge of liver cancer. So what we have discovered in our research is that during cancer progression, some of the cancer cells behave like embryonic cells. Think of this like as travel back into the time. So cancer cells are going back into their embryonic time, which not only allow them to grow uncontrollably, but also allow them to escape the immune response. Dr. Ankur Sharma is the laboratory head at the Harry Perkins Institute of Medical Research. He is working with BGI Group to use BGI's spatial temporal omics technology, StereoSec, to find new ways to combat liver cancer. The biggest problem is there is no molecular marker which can identify between early stage liver cancer, intermediate and advanced stage liver cancer. And that's where we think precision genomics might help us to find molecular biomarker which could allow us to find difference between early versus intermediate or advanced stage liver cancers. With the help of BGS to use technology, now we have started going into the clinical translation area where we are collecting samples from the patient and start asking the question which cell types are present in which spatial localization and how they are important for response of immunotherapy in clinic. Dr. Sharma believes the cutting-edge omics technology BGI provides will be the game-changer patients have been waiting for. When I first saw the data, my reaction was extraordinary because the first time we were able to see the single cell resolution in spatial context and BGS tomics technology allow us to not only identify different cell types in a tumor but also allow us to understand where they are sitting with whom they are talking and what they are talking so they allow us to look into the private life of these cancer cells and which allow us to understand why these communications are important when therapies are working and what goes wrong when therapies do not work Working with researchers like Dr. Sharma is what drives the BGI group to create more ways to map the world's DNA, to help us better understand the basic building blocks of life. This vision has resulted in the establishment of an open scientific alliance, the Spatio-Temporal Omics Consortium, aimed at collaborating on the opportunities presented by technologies like stomachs. Dr. Sharma is just one of the scientists in this group, from leading research institutions across 30 countries. BGI's ongoing commitment to research is leading to the development of new technologies, which is allowing us researchers to make new discoveries in our lab and take the, these discoveries to the clinic. BGI is leading the advancement of this technology worldwide and hopes more researchers will collaborate with them, unlocking new diagnosis, treatments and perhaps even preventative measures. Every individual's tumor is different, and within a tumor, there are different cell types present. By employing precision genomics, we are trying to understand how these tumors are different from each other and what makes them different. This will have huge impact on how we treat the cancer patient, because cancer patient with a particular kind of mutation will be treated with a different kind of drug. This is what we need in cancer research right now, so we can design right drug for right patient at right time.